Update the Hottie Shrine Circus returns to Evansville after last year's cancellation. It also happens as calls for the end of animal performances at circuses goes on. Eyewitness News Mike Pickett with the story. The performers and those who watch them perform both returned after last year's cancellation. I'm actually looking forward to seeing the circus again. I haven't been here in about three or four years, so so it's kind of good to come see it again. What in the show are you looking forward to? The clowns. <laughs> why, why the clowns? They're so funny. Dale Thomas of Hottie Shrine says sales this year have been stronger than past years due to a demand for entertainment after the pandemic canceled last year's circus. Some are here for the first time. First time ever to the circus. Others returning for the first time in a while. It's been yes, many years. Since she, when she was a child. So we're going for a granddad. Quite 20 years ago. The return happens as a group of protesters continue their call for the city of Evansville to ban animal performers at entertainment venues over claims of mistreatment and people getting hurt being too close to certain animals. So these animals have been in this industry for decades. So the amount of psychological stress that an elephant or a tiger or bear ha has accumulated over these years is not something that we can easily quantify. But Thomas said Evansville animal control officers and Evansville zoo officials inspected them this week and found everything in order and the animals well cared for. City Commissioner Missy Mosby said earlier this week the Heidi Shriners canceled some performers in the past because they felt the performers weren't following their guidelines. The annual Heidi Shrine Circus runs through Sunday. In Evansville, my picket, Eyewitness News.